guess it's here is where I do it. Right. Lumos. Lumos. Enchanted candles. Wonder where they're heading. I'm going to follow some candles. The candles seem to be leading into the forbidden forest. Hogsmeade Station. The treasure must be nearby. Oh, I suppose a picnic in the forbidden forest. Treasure hunting suits me. Cool. I haven't done it. That's what we're gonna do. I need to go to my gear. I really do like the flying now that I inverted the controls and I'm a little more used to it. Yeah. It's shameful what you've done to helpless beasts. This game should win soundtrack of the year for sure. The more I play, the more I'm like, okay, this this uh, this music's pretty damn good. <laughs> this looks amazing. Dude, I need like so many games built like this, you know. Mm -hmm. Unreal Engine Five is good. Yeah, I mean, just the way this game's laid out and stuff is like bonkers to me. Doc Monkey. Revelio. Revelio. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Lumos. I just found a random cave. I'm, I keep getting fucking sidetracked for the main mission. <laughs> yeah, I've been doing these, uh, these side missions. Catch up. Yeah. Oh, that's right, I did, uh... I can't continue a lot of my stories without learning most of these spells. Yeah. Collect a troll bogey. Interesting. I don't scare her. I do like this scare her. Acquire and use an invisibility potion. Uh, I've got one somewhere. Oh, no, I don't. Any time, any other time we've tried to... Meet up, and she comes up with some excuse or something. <laughs> oh, really? Uh huh. But also, you know, I'm trying to meet up when there's not going to be anyone there. She wants to I mean, to come over tonight mom. when, like, her family's going to be home and stuff, or her mom at least. I feel like her mom's probably always home. Yeah, well, I mean, she doesn't get home until like 5 or 5.30, so, like, when I. When I get home at like you know four forty-five. Here I am, as good as my word. But uh, yeah, probably. But there isn't a my own place. Just invite people over. Okay, now I gotta go find somebody to fight. And use a thunderbird potion against them. Uh, new episode of uh, One Piece was pretty great. Hang on, give me one second. I'm gonna build this fucking big old fight. Oh, you're good. We meet again, Richard Jackson. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. Only a Ravenclaw would travel this far in pursuit of knowledge. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain... A Thunderbrew potions are badass. They bring device. up, like, an Keep entire fucking uh, thunderstorm bird. above you while you fight. Oh shit, really? For, like, support to just kick ass? Yeah, just, like, thunder, as like, imagine, gives, like, hits people with lightning bolts and shit. Shall we? Damn. It's really cool. I say I never really knew what potions I'd want to make, but I just I've used all the potions. Honestly, at this point, they're all really good. Indeed. Oh, okay. A few Except invisibility, because I have a spell for that. So it's like yes. yeah. And if I recall, a lake. All right, what were you saying? 
You've been very helpful. Um, Thank you. Let me try and remember, actually. Surprising how much of this is. I started a new mission, so I'm like. coming back to me. I don't remember what I was talking about. <laughs> hmm. Yes. You know, uh, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Good. I think it was about. I leave you to it. Simply yeah, I think so too, but I still can't remember. It's not refreshing my memory. Last thing I remember is her mom. Home, yeah. Damn it. I don't remember what the fuck I was talking about. What's this? Nothing more than luck. You'll have to fight eventually. Man, I would definitely love like an MMO of this. Yeah, the way they are too, like oh. the way the the spells just shoot and shit, it's incredible. Uh, yeah, if, I mean, it feels pretty damn good. Uh, I remember what I said, and I said the new episode of One Piece was dope. Oh, he's good as his word. Well, Luffy and Kaido are getting ready to start their last battle. Hmm. Because, oh, you know, Luffy's fought him, like, three times, so. Yeah. This will be four. I mean, technically, they fought him five times, but they, the one fight goes right to the next, so. Because Kaido, like, beats Luffy, and then, you know, shit happens. <laughs> Yep. But before that fight concludes, we have... I, I thought it was only going to be Zoro and Sanji's fight we had to watch, but I forgot about Law and Kid, which... Well, that uh, that intro you sent us the other day was really cool. Yeah, that, yeah, that was just a fight for uh, of Zoro and Sanji. Those are the people they're fighting. So the guy who had, like, the flame and the huge wings, that's who Zoro's mm -hmm. fighting. His name is King. And the dinosaur guy with the robot parts. He's a cyborg like Frankie. Um, but he's also ate a dinosaur devil fruit. <laughs> Damn. Um, that's who Sanji's fighting. <laughs> <laughs> and his his name is Queen. So, And he's a fucking rap guy. Like, there's a Damn. big concert going on at the place. Like, when the... Uh, like, when they first get to the island that they're on, Onigashima. Because it's an island that's not part of Wano. <laughs> So they go from Wano to this island, which is now flying in the air and getting ready to land on Wano and destroy an entire city. So, with Kaido's powers. So, one group of people is trying to stop the island, <laughs> while the other group is fighting Kaido and all his people. Something oddly solid. But you place. met you met Law and Kid, right? Yeah. Uh, the two, only two the of the other supernovas. Yeah, they are teaming up against somebody right now. Oh, really? Mm hmm It's not one of the uh, Straw Hats, is it? No. They are technically allies of the Straw Hats for this battle. Which, Kid's not really an ally. He's just more of a... And the enemy of... My enemy is not really my friend, but not, kind of my ally. Because he doesn't yeah. see any of these people as friends. But what's great, there's parts of Wano. So, Law is their ally. Like, they literally formed an alliance. Law and Straw Hat. Luffy. Mm hmm So, they... they they should have formed an alliance, and their alliance is to... Um, they make an alliance to take out Doflamingo and Kaido. And <laughs> Law, like, he, he and Luffy, like, argue a bunch because Law tries to make a plan. Of course, Luffy doesn't follow it. <laughs> Never will. But in Wano, at one point, he's, like, mad about Zoro doing something because Zoro turns around. He's, like... He says, like, Roanoa. Um, and Zoro turns around, and he's like, Oh, hey, what's up, Law? <laughs> Uh, and or no, I think he calls him Trafalgar, his other name. And he's like, eh. he's like, oh Trafalgar, and then he like grabs Zoro by the like scruff of his neck on his uh, shirt, and the look Zoro gives him, the look on like Law's face, it kind of gets starts to sweat a little bit because it's like, oh, this isn't Luffy. <laughs> you don't you don't grab Zoro by the shirt. Like Luffy's gonna get mad, but it's more of a like. You know, it's not as serious mad like when he gets about like people that he ends up fighting. Yeah. Zora was like ready to to fight, and the kid was like, "Oh shit!" <laughs> <laughs> it's like, yeah, you don't know, fuck with them, boy. <laughs> but yeah, that I just love. Are they still relevant, Law and Kid? Like, are they strong? 
Uh, yes, they're not Luffy level, but they are fighting Big Mom together. But Luffy's fighting Kaido by himself, so there's the difference in, in power. <laughs> Luffy is fighting the strongest creature in the world, and Law and Kid are fighting an old fat lady. <laughs> <laughs> Sure, she's huge. She's like 25 feet tall or something, but still.